Today I am shopping at the Goodwill bins. If you have not been to the Goodwill bins, it's all these big blue bins full of stuff and they bring out new ones all day long and you just dig and see what you can find. It's like a treasure hunt because every time I come, it's all new different things. I love these the little wooden tops. Oh, kind of all messed up. I think I'm gonna leave these here. What are these? <gasps> some little basket sleighs that's adorable they kind of messed up though they're not sitting up on their own very well mm, i think i'm gonna leave these here too let's see what's down this way it's a pot oh it's heavy hmm. i'll put this in my car and think about it i love the color of it i just don't know if i like the shape of it oh here's a sand castle that looks like a sand castle it's really cute uh, i think i'm gonna leave that here but i like it what are these things what in the world is it i feel like i need to look that up that looks like something i'm gonna look that piece up Ooh, a Lazy Susan. I never, ever find these. Oh, this would be so cute painted up with IOD transfer or something on it. Let's see what's down here. I see some brass. What is this? What in the world is this thing? I think this might be a, is that for a curtain rod? I don't know. Oh, this is pretty glass oh I love this I don't see any markings on it but I really like it some duck figurines um it has some markings on it but I'm not crazy about the colors all right I look this up it's a vintage soldier walking toy it's not selling for a ton but I still want to rescue it so I'm gonna leave it in my cart oh an eight ball Will I find good stuff today at the Goodwill bins? Oh, come on. It's broken. What does that mean? Oh, it says ask again. Hmm. I'm going to take that as a yes. They just took out some bins that I did not dig through yet. All right, I need to hurry and make the rounds. But good news is they're about to bring out some new bins. Spalt scrap. Lots of dishes right here. Some DVDs. Was that a deer? I can't tell. It needs to be cleaned up. That's cute. Oh, I hear them. They're bringing out new bins. Oh, I wonder what went in here. That would be pretty. They're bringing out new bins right there. Looks like all clothing and shoes though, so I think I'm gonna keep digging over here. That's plastic. Some little figurines. Don't really sell figurines very well. This little angel reading a book. Oh, it's a planter. She looks a little weird. I like angels with little chubby faces and cheeks. This piece is interesting. Let's see. It says something at the bottom, but I cannot read it. Oh, it says liquid bottle. Here's a bunch of brown pottery. It has a signature. It says oven proof USA. It says something, and then this one says vinegar. Know what that says Hall USA I don't like the colors though so I think I'm gonna leave them here for somebody else that'll enjoy them oh that is pretty I like this I think I'm gonna give that to my neighbor <laughs> I've given her lots of angels this holiday season but she gets so excited when I give them to her that is adorable. 
Look how cute this is. It's like a little seashell holder with some little seashell salt and pepper shakers. Love this. Just found me a whole outfit. I found these Free People black denim jeans. I just have to try them on because I don't know, that rip might be a little bit too big for me. And then I found a Sam Edelman cute little denim shirt. It looks great with black uh, pants. And then y'all volatiles are my favorite shoes to wear. These are one size bigger than I normally wear, but I figured I might as well try it. And look how good three these three pieces look together. So I just have to try it on, make sure everything fits, but the clothing's so cheap here. It's just, it's no big deal. I just pick it up and we try it on. If it doesn't work, then I just re-donate it. So over here, the clothing is pay by the pound and then all the other stuff is just priced per item. And it's just so cheap that I just don't even really worry about um, the prices. If I find something I like, I just go ahead and grab it. Looks like there is lots of clothing today. There's some little figurines, but I'm gonna keep digging. I'll keep digging and hopefully they bring out some new bins as well. Update on the clothing because I have tried them on since this video. I love the shirt and the shoes. They fit great, look great. The pants fit me like a glove, but my husband said that the knees look like they've been chewed up by a dog. So I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think. There's an oldie, but a goodie. This ab machine is so good. If you need one piece of equipment <laughs> at your house, this is definitely a good one. Actually, <laughs> I might need that one at my house. I'm gonna put it in my cart. That way if I can't make it to the gym, still good, a very good ab workout. They are rolling out some new bins right now. Go dig through those. Fortunately, the ones that they took away, I did not dig through yet. There's a little sleigh, oh, a bunny, a bunny. Oh, he's missing a piece of his little ribbon. All right, all I found in that cart was this little bell. Oh, also, I don't think I showed y'all this, but I did end up picking up this plant. I don't like what's in it, but it has a good galvanized base, and it already has moss and foam right here, so I can just go ahead and add my own plant to it. I found this little deck of cards. They all have this little vintage print on them that I just love, so I grabbed that. I think I have actually looked through all of the bins here and not too much today. It's just lots of clothes, lots of toys lately. Not, um, you know, the things that I am looking for, but as with thrifting, it's always just hit or miss. You just have to come often and see what you can find. Let's check out, see if there's any furniture or anything here. I have some pumpkins right here. They even pre-lit. Here's a record player. Let's see what's over here. Oh, it's some toner. I wonder if this is the kind of toner I need. Oh, I'm gonna have to see what number I need. That would be amazing. I just spotted this brass clock. That is so cute. I love this. I might have to keep this one. I kept it. It looks perfect right here in this little vignette. All right, I checked all the boxes and unfortunately none of them are compatible with my laser printer. I was thinking about leaving, but they started dumping the bins on both sides. So this wall and this wall, they are about to restock. So I guess I'm going to hang around and wait and see what they put out. They are finally about to start restocking the walls. Waiting right here, I spotted this little metal Christmas tree. It is gold and glittery, which is a little disappointing because you know how I feel about glitter. But I love that it folds up flat and I like the way it looks. If the glitter is too much, I can definitely just go ahead and paint it black. So I think I'm gonna get this piece. All right, I found a few things while digging through the walls. I got another one of these. I have a whole collection of them now in my kitchen and I think they look so good together. I have all kind of different heights and this one's a little bit shiny so I may paint it but we'll see how it looks with everything else. I got some pink florals. I got these playing cards. These are pink and then they have the ones with the pink background and the white background and I just really like them. 
I don't know what I'm gonna do with them yet. So if you have any ideas, let me go. No, I'm gonna put those in that basket so they don't get lost. I think this is a milk glass hand, but I am not positive. So if you know it, if you know exactly what this is, definitely leave me a comment below. And I got this, but now that I see it out in the light, it looks very plasticky and bright. So I think I'm gonna put that wreath back. Then I got this bucket. I don't know if I'm gonna put something over this, but I really like the look of it. And it even has a little wooden handle right here. And then I found another one of these. This is my third one that I found. It's a little basket with some hooks. So, so cute. And then, you know, you can cover up those little apples if you don't like them. Or I think you might be able, oh, you can't turn around because of the pigs. <laughs> but I just painted over these. And then this was really, really cute. And I got two little ballerina dancing dresses for Wren, a pink one and a mermaid looking one. So she is going to love those. I have to head out. I have so much work to do. So I need to go before they pull out some new bins and I get stuck here again because I have to know what is in the new bin. So I hope y'all enjoyed this shopping trip. I will put a total on the screen of what I spent today and I will see y'all in the next one.